I'll have a blue Christmas without you I'll be so blue thinking about you Decorations of red on a green Christmas tree and they won't mean a thing dear if you're not here with me and no windows blue snowflakes start falling that's windows blue memories start calling Today we're going to be learning how to play Blue Christmas by Elvis. Um, this um, version of it was taken from a video uh, where Elvis is performing live on YouTube and if you want to check that uh, video out you can use the link that is supplied at the bottom of the screen and go there and check, you know, check the video, take a look at it and listen to it. Also once you learn this you can play along with the, the video, okay, play along with Elvis Presley if you learn this version, okay? We're going to be playing this in the key of uh, E major and so we're going to just go right, right now we're going to go down the chord list so you uh, can be familiar with the chords before you start trying to learn how to play it. E is the first chord. That's an E major chord right there. And that's a textbook E major chord. I'm going to use it by using my, taking my two middle fingers, putting them at the second fret on the A and the D string. Follow, following that with a G sharp at the first fret with the first finger and that's my E and I'll sound all my strings on that chord. Okay, that's an E major. Now the next chord is an E7 and we're going to get an E7 by simply removing the third finger right there or the ring finger. Take that out and you've got an E7 chord. Now, that's E major, E7. You might practice that movement. Okay, next, we're going to have to learn to play a B7 chord, which is real easy. We've got our finger here on the note B. Bring this finger down. Ring finger goes down to the same fret. Skip a string. Bring in your finger back here at an E flat. And that's a B7 chord. Now we're going to need to also add the pinky on this to get this full sound. So we're going to have to go down here to F sharp and get that F sharp note down here on the same fret. That's the second fret. Pinky down on the E string right there. Okay? That's a B7. And we need that version just to get the sound of the record going. Okay? Now you can play your B7 like this. Leave off the pinky if you can't manage that, but that makes it sound a little bit more like the song with the F sharp added. Okay, now we're going to move to an A chord, which is a textbook A. Second fret, and we're covering the D, the G, and the B string. A chord. Okay, and the last chord, which is a little bit more difficult, it's a F sharp chord. And we're going to have to, now how do you get that chord? Start with an F. That's an F chord. Right there. Raise at a half step. We now have an F sharp. So we use an F form. Just move it up half step to get the F sharp chord. And now I'm going to bring my thumb across the top. If you can do that, I can get a bass note out of that, okay? For a little bit more uh, of an effect good musical effect. We'll need that low note later when we try to play the song. So that's an F sharp on top and then you got your F chord down there. Your F sharp, F sharp chord. Okay. So that's our chord list. So we had E, E7, B7, A, and F sharp. Like that. Okay. Now 
that's all the chords we're going to need for the song. So practice your chords. Once you get your chords down, then you want to go ahead and uh, come back to the video and try to play the song. All right, now that we've nailed down the chords, it's time to go ahead and learn to play the song. Okay, we're going to start with an E chord, like this. I'll have a blue Christmas without you. Okay, now, what I did to get that little effect on the E chord was open up the A string, hammer on B flat, up to a B. So it's like that. So I'm striking the string, and then I'm playing an E chord right, right after that. So it's now you don't have to add that part in. If you want to just strum straight ahead, that's just fine. So you're going to go like this. that little effect. There it is right there. A, B flat, B, and then an E chord. All right. I'll have a blue Christmas and a B7 without you. Same thing. I'll be so blue. You're going to stay to B7. Thinking about you back to an E. And then I did my little effect with my pinky here. You can also leave that out, but if you want to add that, you just take your pinky after you played your E chord and you bend on a G. That might take a little practice, but hey, sounds really good. Let's move to decorations of red. Okay. Decorations of red on a green Christmas tree. We've got decorations starting with an E. Decorations of red. E7. You do that by removing your third finger. So that's an E. Remove your third finger. On an A green Christmas tree. G sharp, G, F sharp, F sharp chord, okay? Now you can do it that way, A, G sharp, G, and then F sharp. And I'm just showing you the way that I did it, or you can just play it straight ahead. You can go um, A, strum it, and then go straight to your F sharp chord, just like that skip the little uh, note movement that I did in there. Just go straight. Decorations of red A on a green Christmas tree F sharp And they won't need a thing, dear B7 Cause you're not here with me Okay, so you can do it that way. So you have your choice on that. All right, now let's move to the next verse, which is, And when those blue, that's E, snowflakes start falling, falling is B7. Back to E. Start calling in that G. You'll be due. We're staying at an E. Doing all right. E7 with your Chris A Christmas F sharp. Why? But I'll be seven. Have a blue. And 
that's Elvis's Blue Christmas. Uh, play along with this video, learn how to play this song, uh, and go to the uh, link, or use the link to move to the uh, Elvis video where Elvis is performing this song live and play along with Elvis. Thanks again for stopping in the E-Music Live, and Happy New Year to everyone.